course of the Big Ten and the team destined to carry their colors into the Rose Bowl game was Michigan State's great team, called by many the finest in the land. Against Wisconsin, the Spartans, great sophomore, Walt Kowalczyk, rockets into the end zone. And what a football player this boy is going to be when he grows up. Here's that fabulous sophomore again, Kowalczyk. Through the line, he twists away from two defenders. Watch this straight on. Bam! Which way did he go? Simple. Over the goal line, of course. Another one. Like running into a Mack truck. Another contributor to the Wisconsin route was Dennis Menzik. Here he busts into the clear and zips his way 56 big yards before he's finally halted on the 18-yard line. Here's a bit of clever ball handling by quarterback Jimmy Nanowski. He fools one and all, then fires a perfect pass to Bob Jewett, and it's another six points for the Spartans. And the whole crowd hoops it up. Against Purdue, brilliant Clarence Peake showed why he was feared by all as he carries into the end zone on a sweep. Here's how to baffle the enemy. It's the seldom seen pitch out to the end around. And it picks up vital yardage. Quarterback Earl Morrill did more than his share to guide the Staters to Pasadena. Purdue's Murakowski tries to ladder, but Morrill intercepts, and there's nothing but daylight between him and the Boilermaker goal line. Earl turns on the speed and outruns the lone defender. A Purdue threat is converted into a Spartan touchdown. Here's a play that didn't help Minnesota at all. It's a kicking situation. Jerry Planutas blocks Kel Kleber's punt, and then Dave Kaiser scoops it up for a state touchdown. Kaiser? They saw too much of that guy in the Rose Bowl. Morrill was at his best faking with the ball. Here's a fake that played a nice reward. It goes to Jerry Planutas, who scampers 53 yards before he is finally hauled down. Planutas is one of the smallest but greatest backs in the Big Ten. More dipsy-doodle handling by Morrill. But he's going to throw. And he does perfectly into the arms of the man Kaiser again. Michigan State, with their multiple offense, really gave the opponents fits. Here they shift to the single wing right. Walt Kowalczyk takes the ball and heads around left end. And Walt is almost decapitated on this head tackle. Michigan State had a field day in running up 42 points against Minnesota. On this play, Nanowski pitches to Jim Hinesley for six. And it's the Rose Bowl for Duffy Doherty's fine squad. 